Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back. My name is Ace and I got another TF2 live commentary here for you. Playing some Pyro, doing some King of the Hill Nucleus. It feels like it has been forever since I touched this map. So talking about touching things, let's touch that medic and make his life end rather prematurely as the rest gets taken out as well, courtesy of, of course, the minigun. Which is a wonderful thing to take down people with. Also, do not touch that sentry for it shall be standing tall and... Privilege. I'm not sure where I'm going with this. Anyway, I'm gonna burn this pyro down. Fight fire with fire as I go back and just refill everything to the uh, brink. As I have to go to the midpoint, as it has been captured, but I think is a scout, judging by the amount of people, of course. Which is one, and he's capping with two speed, which usually means a scout. But then again, that flare gun combo just ruining his day. Anyway, how are you guys doing? I'm doing well. Finally got some sleep that is somewhat respectable, uh, five to six hours, which is good for my, uh, for me at least. Not because it's good, but I usually last for two to three hours in the heat that I'm currently in, the humidity as well. And I just feel like I'm dying and I'm feeling a little bit better, so I'm looking forward to stream tonight. Probably if you are watching this video, I may be online or I might be about to go online, depending on uh, when I release the video. Let's capture this point as well and... I wanted to talk a little bit of something. Uh, if you watch my Smite videos, you may already have seen it. Because I want to change up my YouTube channel a little bit. Because I feel like it has been slowing down a tad bit. And that's never healthy. Slowing down in a medium like YouTube or Twitch or whatever is never a good idea. So I want to do something about that. Now, I'm not going to stop TF2 content. Don't worry about that just yet. The vast majority is here for TF2 content. So it would hurt my channel if I were to stop TF2 content. On top of that, and more importantly, I still enjoy TF2. So it would just be silly to stop making videos about TF2 because I still enjoy them. I'm trying to protect this point, but it's not gonna happen. Anyway, but I do want to switch away from the MOBAs. So I'm trying to find new games. And not specifically a new game to play, but what type of games I should play. So if you have any suggestions to what types of game uh, I or what type of games I should play, please let me know. Uh, and don't be cheesy and say, yeah, we just want to see more TF2 content, because that's not going to happen, guys. I'm not going to make more TF2 content, because I want to have diversity on my channel. I've said this for a very long time, and I'm not going to stop doing that. Get away! Oh, he gets the stab, though. Who do? He gets the stab. I thought I could get an air blast on him, but yeah. Like I was saying, I want to keep diversity on my channel with at least three or more games. Um, preferably three games. That's, I think that's a good balance. Three different games running on my channel. Right now it's TF2, Smite and Dota 2. But I want to move away from that. Now, to give you a bit of a reason why I'm moving away from MOBAs. Is because... Why would you watch me play MOBAs? There's no real way. Like, I could at least argue that I'm decent at TF2. I'm just messing about, right? As well as I'm in a... Uh, a um, and shoutcast, so I have that link to, of course, the competitive scene as well, which is wonderful. Did I save that soldier? No, I did not. I'm so sorry, soldier. So at least there's that. With, with MOBAs, who would you rather watch? Somebody who's learning the game or a pro? Would you rather watch a commentator or somebody who's learning the game? Because I'm not doing something super hilarious. I'm not doing something out of the ordinary. I'm just learning the game and show that to you guys. And that's... Um, didn't really both well for my channel, I find. Like, it's not like I hate the game, absolutely not. I still will play the games, just not on the stream, nor on the YouTubes, if you will. Which is why I'm looking for different games to play. And I hope you guys will respect it, and I hope you guys will think with me, and not against me. I hopefully, uh, I hope that you guys are mature enough to understand my position in this, and help think with me instead of against me. I would really appreciate that. You know, bringing that community, uh, force on the service and hopefully uh, perhaps bring an answer to me that I would have not thought about myself if I had to think all of, all for myself I suppose anyway long story short I would like to have your input and uh, I will read the comments you can twitter uh, you can twitter me you can send me a message or just the comments probably your best bet and try to be a good time did I just get a reflect right there I'll take the domination not sure what happened there but I'll take it as we are looking at a flawless round right here it's a, it's a good time. It's a good time. Alright, let's just take out this spy. Not gonna have... Oh, hello, scout. How are you doing? That's a meat shot right there. He just was outside of my flame range, but he did jump off. Did I air blast him up or did he just jump off? Nonetheless, I am scoring the MVP, capping off those, uh, those control points. Kind of neat. Not too bad with my score right here. A lot of people always get fussy when I check my score out, but... It's king of the hill, you know, it's it's... 
I'm gonna have a good time if I, you know, score a lot of points, which I usually do by keeping the objective in mind and murdering everybody who is against the objective or against my objective, which is keeping that point, of course. If you are trying to capture that point, I will murder you. Because I just don't care if you die. I don't. I really don't. Oh, that flare gun, though. That's one of the reasons why I just love that flare gun. I love the flare gun, guys. You know that. You have seen me getting some very extreme kills with the flare gun. The combos, the crits, long range distance crits. It's amazing what you can do with the flare gun. This is once, uh, why it's my favorite. It's not the best weapon. It's definitely a personal preference, if you will. Uh, shotgun definitely has its uses. I tend to use the shotgun if there's too many pyros on the enemy team. I think it's alright right now. So we're gonna have a good time. Looks like I'm gonna be the first one touching that point. Gonna touch it. Touch it. Touch it. Alright. Oh, nice meat shot there by AZ there on Yippee. And, of course, I'm the one that captured the point. Guys, there's an objective here. Team, please. Please help me cap so I can burn people down. Like, for example, this scout. Spinkster NL, your life just got a lot hotter. Or actually, no, it stopped being... I don't know, what, what, how do you would say that? Oh, the X, though! The X, right in his face. That's not Spunky. I'm just passing by. Just passing by, guys. He just happened to walk into my fire. That's all. Oh, the nice jump to avoid that flare crit, though. Very nice jumps here by this scout. The afterburns are good enough. I'm not sure what happened there. Did he explode? Did I take damage from the bombing car? Is that even a thing? Or was it just something else? No, it's not. I was really getting confused about that. But it's actually a soldier right here. With the black box. No, it's a, a beggar's bazooka. And you can bag your bazooka all you want, sir. But my reflect will still take your life. And I don't feel sad. In fact, I am rather happy with that. I rejoice in your explosive death. I feel comfort. I, I, I feel happiness coming from seeing your body splash into a thousand pieces. God, I'm a psychopath. I'm a high-functioning psychopath or a sociopath. What's the one that Sherlock says? Sherlock, help. Anyway, it's probably time to move on to the point, though. Taking a little bit too much damage because they Liberty Launcher, of course. Shooting four rockets now, getting a double reflect there. Maybe a triple reflect, getting the kill as well. Trying to defend the point and we are able to do so, but I'm like 21 health left. I do see a sniper and scouts there, so I have to casually walk out. Pretend that I'm not a dangerous thing. Oh, nope, that's that's stupid. Yeah, of course, you can, I, I, I knew he was going to move to the left, but for some reason I didn't move my cursor to the left. I stick to the same position. Never do that as, against a scout, because they're going to move. They are going to move. They're scouts. If you're going to stand still, it's, you're going to have a bad time. This is also when, when I'm playing a sniper and somebody stands still. I'm always having a hard time um, hitting them sometimes, because I expect them to move. New players or inexperienced players in every game always have a certain difficulty level to them because they are they are not uh, predictable, if you will. Just like that rocket that I did not see coming. And what you don't see coming, you cannot predict. So Robocop getting a nice picture on me. Getting all kinds of items right here. God, I hate these things. I don't care, guys. I don't care. I don't care about you like you like rage. I just don't. I just don't. Anyway, moving up to that control point, which we have lost it, of course. I do see the rockets from the high ground. Gonna see if I can have that soldier for breakfast. Oh, hello. Trying to get that ground shot, though. I will get the reflex. I am not against that. Oh, I have to go back, though. Gonna have a bad time. Scouts will chase them. Hopefully, they will get them. Robocop getting a lot of kills. So, he's probably a soldier to be reckoned with. Certainly looks like that. So, we'll see what we can do. I'm trying to move on that point now here. If I had the shotgun, I couldn't really do much of anything. But right now, getting a crit right there and an ignite and another crit. Getting another crit and a kill right there. Just flare guns on a heavy. That's uh, engineer is clearly a spy. We see a soldier on the high ground. Gonna ignite him. So he's gonna have a bad time. Actually get the kill there as well. I'm just gonna touch the point. I have sufficient health to tank a few hits. Or at least one hit. That's all. That's... Oh, yeah, I was kind of expecting that Huntsman to happen, though. Trying to look for a reflex, keeping him in the air so he can't use his arrows. Very nice tactic against the Huntsman once you get close as a pyro. Picking up the medium health pack as you do, and I'm going to go around, see if I can uh, get a nice pick off somebody here. Oh! All right, the soldiers don't have afterburn anymore, so think about that. You have to keep them ignited if you want to get the crit on them. Because I believe that they use the charging tark. The, um... The ignite is gone, as you can see. I can't ignite him. It's almost impossible for me to take him out. But that's okay, though. Because there you go. Nice domination on Hoodoo. Another Huntsman... 
uh, well, it's the same sniper with the Huntsman, but there you go. Bus bouncing around, explosions bouncing around as well. So he can't use his arrows. We are about to win the game, but they are trying to get on that point, and rightfully so. I'm just going to use fire to fight fire once more. That soldier looking for an opening. That's okay. I'm not going to pick up the medium health pack. That demo clearly needs it. I'm a team player, guys. Talking about being a team player, I just body blocked that pyro. Totally planned to prevent that demo from being taken out immediately even though he's gonna stay there and he is gonna die in three two one there you go yeah he should have run he should have he tried to turn around which also makes you move back faster if you're gonna buck uh if you're gonna run back faster of course or if you're gonna run backwards that's the words i'm looking for english how does it work well by speaking it correctly that's how it works looks like they're gonna cap this point i'm trying to desperately get to it in time do get another domination though pick up another kill but i only have 84 health left i'm kind of scared of that sniper right there he's looking for it there's the oh the demo but the crit's too strong everybody jumping on that point i'm trying to hit that sniper with a flare gun and i do which means he can't snipe accordingly and there you go another round being victorious being mvp i'm kind of okay with that there you go Look at that score, not too unfortunate uh, about that, not too unhappy with that. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to subscribe if you haven't. And I will catch you guys next time. Take care.